I'm Ian Nicholson. I've been the professional at Kilmacomb Golf Club for 10 years. Kilmacomb Golf Course, um, you know, one of the things that really springs to mind, first of all, is that uh, th th there's a comment made that it's very similar to, to Glen Eagles. And from that point of view, I would say a lot of the terrain, very, very similar. It's a moorland type golf course, quite high up. But, uh, that has its benefits as well. Drains very, very well, so we get golf all year round. Great features out in the golf course. It's it's a very old traditional course. Some lovely old kind of dry stone walls that, that kind of mark out the boundaries. Second hole, lovely par three. The wall on the, the right hand side is very much to the forefront of your of your mind. A par three is a good score in that hole. Third hole, lovely hole again. Nice view from the tee. Um, you have a nice view over the naps, which is the the, the loch down below. The eighth hole down the left, it's got a sort of natural heritage site there, uh, which is the Glen Moss. It's a very beautiful place for people to walk and, and also a, an area of great interest to, to many of the you know, sort of local people. Beautiful course all round, great facility and uh, always in great condition as well. The practice facility here at Kilmacombe Golf Club is excellent, ideal for, for corporate days as well. Excellent facility for teaching, we do quite a bit of video coaching. Terrific to be able to come up here and hit any length of shot and have plenty of space to do so. Feature of the golf course, in particular holes such as the 11th and the 13th, there's a section of trees which were planted in the 1970s. This gives a nice feeling of, of privacy when you're out there playing on, on the different golf holes. It partitions them nicely and uh, it really adds to the golf course, I would say. Fourteenth hole, nice wide open fairway. You really feel as though you can hit a long drive off that one and not be in any trouble. The real interest, I think, comes with the second shot. You're hitting over a rock face which is a real feature of this particular golf hole and when you get to the putting green there's some interesting undulations to deal with as well. 16th hole, beautifully scenic when you get up to the top of the, of the green, it's one of the highest points in the golf course. 17th hole, nice little short par 3, it's an interesting hole, a lot of the, uh, the visiting parties that come to Kilmacomb use it as nearest the pin, obviously it keeps the interest going late into the round. I think it's important to say that the golf course, 6,000 yards, it's a nice length for, for all golfers. Not too long, so hopefully at the end of the day, golfers are not going to feel too tired when they finish their game. But um, also a great challenge for low handicap golfers as there's many sort of tight tee shots and, and tight landing areas to deal with as well. <laughs>